From 5k gold to 6 million gold. If you want to be king of the pirates, follow my steps and you'll get at least 1 million gold in almost an hour. Thank you to Calypso Media for the free game. Also forgive my voice, I'm kind of sick, but I'm still doing the content. As a brand new game, you won't have any skills, so you'll have to sink and or capture ships on your own for just a minute. But after you first divide the booty and gain some skill points, you should have at least two skill points. I have three, but you should have at least two. If you want to go ahead and go with Boarding Frenzy and Boarding Expert. And you will want to get Boarding Frenzy up to level 5 as fast as possible. Alright, so as soon as you get into battles, uh, preferably pick battles that you can win. You're going to have this crew size at the bottom left, and you're going to have the boarding strength. Now, when we look at the other ship, you're going to see their crew size and their boarding strength. We are going to buff ourselves with boarding frenzy, the ability, and then board their ship. This is really the only tactic we'll be using for the whole time. But make sure you stick around because I'm going to tell you how to get the most money out of each ship that we capture. Because boarding ships is how you capture ships, and selling ships is how you get the most gold, and that's how we're going to rack in all the money. You can see that our crew size is almost the same, but when I activate boarding frenzy, I get a jump in boarding strength versus their boarding de uh, defense. And so I have an 84 strength versus 50 defense, and that's really what's going to be what wins almost 90% of the battles. Whenever you do board a ship and capture the ship, some of your crew will be lost. That's just part of the game. <clears throat> so you wanna make sure you stick around close to every port so that you can go to the tavern and pay to get more seamen. Because if you get in too many battles in a row, you're eventually gonna have no seamen left to actually board a ship and then lose the ship yourself. After you've won, I think, four or five battles with the Spain ships, you can go to uh, Seville and I'll show you that on the map. And you can get Dayron Esposito. And the nice thing about him is that he already comes with a pirate bark. And he also has the boarding frenzy skill. So this means that you can double your efforts in securing ships really fast. And as you can see here, I, I had the boarding frenzy at level 5 as soon as possible. So I really divided the booty only twice. So once you repair your ship, gather more crewmen at the tavern for each port. You, you then want to sell the ships that you have captured. When you go to the Harbor Master and sell, make sure that you also click to sell the improvements. For whatever reason, the game doesn't sell the ship with the improvements. You have to select each one for it to count. And I'll show you this here, as I tested it just for you guys. I went to sell the ship for 20,000 gold. And then if you sold the frame with it, you got 31,000 gold. I took the frame off just to see if it would sell it with the ship which was only 20,000 and it only sold for 20,000. So make sure that you also select every single improvement on that ship if you're gonna sell it because that's gonna maximize your output. If you're new to the game or you're struggling with combat, check out this video right here that goes through a basic tutorial for sinking ships and capturing ships. <laughs> 